haben wir exakt zwei Stunden Aufenthalt, bevor wir in Richtung Zagreb weiterreisen, unserem endgültigen Reiseziel. I know where to go. A way to get inside Eisenberg Prison. There's a hotel, it's on the same street as Secret Police Headquarters. Everybody knows about it. Secret Police Headquarters is notorious here in Berlin. They bring prisoners inside for questioning. They torture them. And then they drive them back to Eisenwald prison. If they're still alive. Something's happening. There's a prison transport arriving. Come quickly! All right, ladies and gents, welcome back. I'm your host, Sinistra 1. We have more Wolfenstein, the new order. Hopefully you're enjoying the walkthrough so far. I'm coming. Keep your pantyhose on. All right, escaping prisoner eaten by Panzerhunden. Hunden. <laughs> Berlin, October 12th, 1960. A prisoner trying to escape Eisenwald last week found himself in the belly of the beast when he was eaten alive by one of the guard Panzer. The guards tried to pull out the prisoner from the middle jaws of the Panzer, but the superiority of Reich technology made the rescue attempt futile. The prisoner was a convicted murder and rapist who will certainly not be missed by anyone. The question is, who was it? Was it uh, one of our comrades or something like that? All right, as far as everything else, I don't see anything else inside this room, so we are going to continue on. I know, I'm coming. All right, so let's do it. They're making a pickup. You find a way to get down on the roof of that prison transport bus. You hide on that roof and you can ride it all the way into Eisenwald prison. I go down and distract the guard. And maybe he won't see you. Alright, so here we go. I gotta say, I love the cutscenes. I love how fluid they are. You can actually see her right there doing some distraction for me. Again, we're gonna try to get as many of the collectibles as we can. Uh, of course, I go in every mission not really knowing um, if I'm gonna be able to collect them all, but I will try my best, of course, to keep the gameplay nice and smooth for you guys as well. So let's see what we got in some of these extra rooms here. Serial killer on the loose, a murder duo suspect. Berlin, October 11th, 1960. The rash of murders which has plagued the city for the last couple of months may be the work of a degenerate murder duo. Sources close to the investigation say so far five people have been killed. Each victim was found dismembered and scattered throughout the sewers. Witness reports speak of two strong men, most likely mentally and physically disabled, lurking around the crime scenes. They did not look like normal, decent Berlin folk to me, says one of the witnesses. Must have been them who did this awful thing. All right, so it looks like we found one of our first collectibles already. Sweet. Got a letter. Okay, of course I'll let you guys kind of just skim through that. Again, you can do the magic mysteries of pausing at any second. And there you go. All right, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six Enigma codes. We already got the letter, four gold pieces, and those are mainly the things that we need to pick up. There's no health upgrades in this one. So we've collected every collectible so far. Let's check out our perks here. We need one more stealth kill with throwing knives to increase the amount of knives that we can carry. And perform silent takedowns with overcharged health. So try to keep that in mind too. What does that actually get? It gets more maximum health level. Okay. So we're almost all the way up on our stealth. Which is really cool. Stealth kills melee or ranged. The Kampflums, I believe, are the dogs, so we need two more dogs to get the Assassin. Which will come in handy. Of course, we really want to uh, make Stealth and Tactical our most, our, our biggest priorities, so. Alright, here we go. She's still down there, working her charm. Really appreciate the positive feedback on the uh, video so far. We're getting good views, so I'm glad to see uh, some more people are uh, tuning in to this walkthrough. Uh, it looks like we've got some sections that we're going to be able to get into inside. We just need to figure out, I guess, how to get over there. One step at a time. 
All right, so if we check out our map, obviously we don't got anything. We do have something up straight ahead. But I'll look around just for a second, see if I see anything in particular. We got an upstairs. We got somewhat of a gold. Okay. So we have to, I guess, we have to figure out how we can get in there. All right, so let's see what we got here. All right. Curious gadget. Useless without a battery. Love how he throws his knife like that. Okay, as far as anything, I don't see anything right around here, so it's probably right here. Laser cut. Needs recharge. All right, so these require batteries, I guess, to uh, to operate. But I think probably what we're going to have to do is right here, as you can see. Maybe just a little. Sp Alright, so we need a little bit more in order to be able to get that, or maybe I just wasn't fast enough. Alright, so we'll see if there's any more up available somewhere. Alright, sweet. So that dev that definitely gave us a max there, so we can finish this up. That is pretty cool, though. I love games that incorporate things like this. And then there you go. <laughs> That's so cool. Nice. All right, so we got our gold plate. Let's take a look at it. Beautiful. All right, what else we got here? Can we can do this to all different kinds of stuff? So I'm definitely going to be checking grates and things like that that we might be able to use this type of opportunity with. So we need to get into there to cut fences. So my guess would be to cut this fence here, and then we can do it. We can probably do it with that one too. So it doesn't really matter which one we cut. Make sure we always have a full charge as much as possible. And let's see, anything else? Nope. All right. So we'll cut this one. Sweet. This needs a big enough to jump through, I'm guessing, right? <laughs> Look at that. We can jump right through that. Okay, so let's check this out here before we continue and move on. Like I said, there always could be something behind. Something shiny right there, actually. Again, I don't want to make too big of a hole because I want to see if I can do it without... Yep. I'm gonna get in there. All right, sweet. Gold frame. All right, so only two more gold pieces left and we're just kind of moving right along. Before I continue, I want to make sure that I am fully charged... All right, good. We get to keep the weapon? Yes, we do. All right, sweet. I don't know why he didn't keep any of his previous weapons. Maybe he couldn't because he was on the train. Makes sense. All right, so we got a commander around. Let's see if we can't take this guy out nice and silent lack. I mean, not poor guy, but you know what I mean. Whew, man, we came in here and just wrecked this place. Alright, so let's look around a little bit, I guess. Ja, 
Frage zur Antwort. Lecken Sie mich doch am Arsch, Sie Drecksack. Sie sind eine Schande für die ganze Operation. Ich nehme keine Befehle mehr von Ihnen entgegen. Verstanden? He's not too happy with that guy, is he? Okay, so let's see what else we got here. We got some more things to read off. Inside the Siberian Training Grounds. Moscow, October 12, 1960. Located near the northern part of the Ural Mountains. Not far from the Karisi, the Death's Head Commando. Training camps are considered to be the toughest in the world. In a series of investigative reports, we reveal how these fierce combatants manage to live through their days in extreme cold temperatures and how it makes them the superior warriors. All right, so it looks like we got a map. That's sweet. And okay, we just have a we have to take out the commander here somewhere close. I'm sure once we take out him, then all of the secrets will unlock. All right, what do we got here? Okay, that's just a file. Didn't say that it was something in particular. Oh, well, this lighted up though. Oh, hey, right. what do we got in here? You love these kind of facilities like this. They're just doing everything right in this game so far. They're making it really fun. All right, sweet. Another Enigma code. All right, as far as anything else, I don't see anything else in here. Again, I'm going to check the room where the dog was just to be safe again. Because I really didn't look too thoroughly in here. What if you can use the laser cutter on the enemies too and you'll watch them slice or something? <laughs> Alright, so I know the he's in a room up ahead. See, these cameras scare me because I don't know if they're actually seeing me or not. But I guess they're not, so... Again, we... Just got to get to the commander and then all the other secrets will show up if there's anything left in this area. Okay. Let's check it out. We have one more secret in here. Sweet. Alright, so as far as this building, so far we've been everywhere, and all of the secrets have been good to go. First Germans land on moon. Berlin, July 21st, 1951. At 3.56 yesterday afternoon, astronaut Hans Armstack, Armstark became the first man to walk on the moon. First contact with the moon's surface was made 30 minutes after Armstark and his co-pilot, Emmerich Otto, steered the lunar module to its landing spot in an area known as the Glimmer Bowl. After the landing, the two astronauts began their adventure on the moon by planting the beautiful flag of the Reich. They then started collecting soil and rock samples for further analysis back on Earth. Wow, they did it in 51? What's this game trying to say that they're, uh, they're faster than us? <laughs> I don't know. I, I have my speculation whether or not we really landed on the moon, but there's always that kind of uh, uh, conspiracy theories and whatnot, so... The Moonund! Or is that the Moond? Or something like that. Alright, so that's it for this section here, and we are gonna go ahead and continue on, I guess. Getting closer. Thing in this world worth. 
Earth City. Desolation. Tyranny. Enemy of endless might. I'm wondering if I have any friends left standing. Comes down to it. I'll fight alone. But I promise you this. Friends, if this is where they're keeping you, I will find you and set you free.